drilling oversize. Why is that? So why do drills drill oversize sometimes? We think we know the answer for some of the reasons. If a drill has its point over, over to one side or off center, it'll push the drill to one side. We believe it's gonna drill oversize, it just makes sense. What's another reason? Well, the other reason is that if the chips get plugged up in the flutes, on the way out, the chips could be rubbing against the top part of the hole and the chips themselves will actually do some rubbing and remove a little bit of stock. Not much, but it will do that. We think that that's what causes bell mouth. So we're gonna go back there, we're gonna take our block, we're gonna take a brand new drill, we're gonna drill one hole using the same technique in both cases. We're gonna drill one hole with a brand new drill, the second drill, which will be the same drill, but we're gonna grind a point off center, we're gonna drill that hole, and we're gonna use again the same technique using cutting oil and removing the chip on a regular basis. So let's go back, give it a shot. All right, so here we are, brand new drill. You can see the point there. It looks to be on center. You never know, but you know, it looks like it's on center, right? So we're gonna chuck it up. And I like to twist the drill a little bit when I'm putting it in a chuck, just to make sure there's no chips or dirt behind it. That way you get a good, good tight fit. Here we're using uh, cutting oil. And as you can see, I'm removing the chip on a regular basis, so we're not allowing the chip to, to get stuck in the hole. And uh, when the chips do that, you know, they'll rub against its neighbor and tend to drill a hole oversized. We're going down about three quarters of an inch, is I think plenty deep enough. And again, there I just stopped it. Now we've taken the drill over to the drill sharpener or the bench grinder, and I'm grinding that point off center deliberately an awful lot. I don't know how much, but probably I'm guessing 20 thousandths or more. You can see the flat there. Now here you can see the one side. Look at that. And when we rotate it, you see, look how big that side is. So that side is huge by comparison. So that point is way off center. Lots of dirty nails there. What do you think about that? Anyway, there's your point. Looks good. Now let's go back, put it in the machine, chuck it up, tighten it down, and we'll come in here and drill our hole. And look at that as it's going in. You can see that it's wobbling a little bit. So we know it's going in off center. That hole is definitely gonna be bigger. And again, we're using the same technique, putting cutting oil in there, making sure we pull the chip out on a regular basis. So we wanna treat both holes the same as far as technique is concerned. We don't want one hole to be any different than the other. Well, we'll give a little shot of air here. And we're ready to go. We cleaned it up a little bit. We'll mark it number one and number two. Let's take it up front and let's see what that baby looks like. And I think, looking right here, you can see it with a visible eye that the second hole is way bigger than the first hole. I mean, that's visible. What a difference. Let's go up front. Let's give it a check. Well, there you have it. Hole number one and hole number two. Again, this one with a brand new drill. This one, same drill, grinding the point off to one side or off center. And as you can visibly see the difference in the size. How much bigger is it? Well, let's find out. I'm guessing the first hole should be 250 or quarter inch. Nope, it's a little bigger than that. That's 250. But here's 257, that's a pretty good fit. So even a brand new drill, being as cautious as we were, tends to drill oversize about 7,000. But by the way, this hole is really straight with no bell mouth. I really like that. So it's consistently oversized. Why? Well, could be that the brand new drill point was off center just a little bit. I'm more curious about the second hole. So we'll start with this one. Well, that's a pretty good guess right there. And again, that hole is dead straight. And that size is 281. So it's 31 thousandths oversize. But, it, but look at that, a really straight hole. 
I mean, I'm impressed with that. 281, maybe 282. We can get it in and get it out. I don't know. Oh, there's 282. And it's pretty darn straight. So I guess point is, no pun intended, having a drill point offset or off center will definitely cause the hole to be drilled oversized. And again, the first hole, not sure why it's seven or eight thousandths oversized, but that's the way it came out. And we were very careful using cutting oil, as you saw, and using the same technique and removing the chips. So just a reminder, you like what you see, subscribe, check us out on Facebook, Twitter, etc. And thanks again for watching.